Hello, aspiring audiophiles and audio enthusiasts. Welcome to another episode of How to Listen Like an Audiophile series. I'm Dylan, the project manager at Deconi Audio, and in today's episode, I'm going to talk to you about the various types of equipment audiophiles and hi-fi enthusiasts typically use when listening to music. If you decided to replace your low-performing, casual headphones with a higher-end or top-of-the-line pair of headphones, that's great. However, you're going to quickly learn that in order to use your new headphones, it's going to take more than just simply plugging them into a headphone jack. With that said, we're going to go over a few audio accessories that can greatly improve the way you listen to your headphones, such as headphone amps, DACs, and DAPs. When you get your hands on higher-end headphones, there's a good chance that you will need to have a headphone amplifier. However, this will greatly depend on your headphones' impedance and sensitivity. Impedance is the amount of electrical resistance in your headphones. High impedance headphones, which are generally anything from 50 ohms and higher, will require more power to properly drive the headphones. High impedance is typically a result of the way the headphones have been constructed, such as the amount of copper used in the drivers. Depending on the configuration, headphones made with higher impedance are typically known for producing sound at a much better level. If you don't use an amplifier with high impedance headphones, not only will the headphones sound quiet, but the sound quality won't be as good. This is due to poor power delivery, which will negatively affect certain frequencies and sound reproduction in your headphones. Not only will you need to know your headphones' impedance, but you will also need to know what the sensitivity is. Sensitivity is a measurement of how loud your headphones can be at a certain power level. Headphones typically fall between a sensitivity rating of 90 and 105 dB SPL. Before you purchase an expensive pair of headphones, be sure to check out the specifications on the box or in the description, and look for the headphones' impedance and sensitivity. Once you find either one of these specifications, you can search online for the headphone power calculators and input one of these specifications into the calculator. This can help you determine the type of headphone amplifier you will need. If you are really considering getting your hands on a headphone amplifier, check out popular brands online such as iFi, Shit, Astol & Kern, Audiolab, Cord, and more. Before we move on to DAX, it's important to note that headphone amps are usually a bit chunky and aren't as portable as, say, your smartphone. So, this particular device is best suited for people looking to listen to their music at their desks or office spaces. A digital audio converter, or DAC, is a device that converts digital signals from your computer into analog sound signals. The analog signal is the sound you hear in your headphones. All computers come with a built-in DAC. However, it's possible that the DAC located in your computer's motherboard is unable to handle the requirements of high-quality headphones, and it could cause annoying electrical noise. To avoid this, you can purchase an external DAC completely separate from your computer and any potential electrical noise. The chips used in external DACs are usually higher quality than what goes in your computer or phone. That's why many people choose them. You use your DAC in conjunction with an amplifier to deliver a much better listening experience. It's also important to note that there are some DACs with built-in amplifiers, making you only need to purchase one device as opposed to two. DAC amplifiers are combination hardware that can save space and allow for more portability. Typically, DAC amps can also be cheaper than buying two separate pieces. You also won't need to worry about having too much cable. Again, if you're interested in checking out some popular DACs and DAC amps by notable manufacturers, be sure to check out devices from iFi, Shit, Audiolab, and many more. A DAP, or digital audio player, is a great fit for those wanting to listen to high-quality audio on the go. A digital audio player is like a high-end iPod. It is a portable device that is capable of storing and playing a large sum of digital audio files. If you don't know this already, there are many different digital audio formats, with some better than others. The great thing about DAPs is that they are able to play high-resolution and lossless digital audio files. These types of files have a higher bit depth or sampling frequency than CDs. Even though these higher quality or lossless files are still compressed files, they are still able to maintain the greatest detail and information. DAPs come in many shapes and sizes, and it takes a bit of research to find one of the best suited for you. Some popular high quality DAPs are made by Astell & Kern, Sony, Questile, Pioneer, and more. If you are someone who wants to have the ability to take their high resolution music library with them outside the house, then a DAP is the device for you. A lot of people use their cell phones for music listening. With the abandonment of the 3.5mm jack and the growth of the Bluetooth devices, 
many people have distanced themselves from wired headphones with their phones, and there have been many high quality Bluetooth headphones now available. Those more interested in achieving the upper echelon of listening experience with their phones still find themselves using wired headphones with dongle DACs. Dongle DACs are very small and portable devices that come with a lightning or USB-C to 3.5 millimeter input that is capable of playing high resolution digital audio files from your cell phone or portable devices. If you're using a streaming site with HD music files, such as Kobuz or Tidal, this device can help bring out the quality you're looking for while on the go. If you're someone who's invested in high quality headphones that require more power to drive, there are plenty of dongle DACs that also double as headphone amplifiers. This makes it possible for you to listen to your favorite headphones outside of your house or office space. If you're interested in finding a dongle DAC, check out Apple, iFi, Fio, AudioQuest, THX, Advanced Audio, and many more. All right, audiophile in training. That wraps up our crash course on the various devices audiophile and hi-fi enthusiasts use to achieve high quality listening experiences. Even though devices such as DAX, DAPs, and amplifiers can have varying prices that can add up very quickly, they all exist to help you achieve a greater listening experience. Not everyone is going to need a DAP while they listen on the go. Not everyone will want to upgrade their computer setup with a DAC. This will depend entirely on your needs and what you want out of your music listening experience. With all that being said, if you're in need of storage for your various audio devices, we have two types of cases available on our website. We have our headphone savior carrying case, perfect for someone who wants to keep their expensive audio accessories, such as a DAP or amplifier, safe and protect it while on the go. You can also keep your headphones stored safely in here as well. If you're looking for a more robust and durable carrying case while traveling, then you should consider our Headphone Hero carrying case. This case comes compact with various features such as a strong outer shell for elite protection, a pressure seal for air travel, thick EVA foam padding, space for your audio devices, and a detachable Omega stand for your headphones. If you're interested in any of these carrying cases, you can find them at DaconiAudio.com. Make sure to give this video a like if you found it helpful, and subscribe for more videos to come in the future. We have a few more videos for our How to Listen Like an Audiophile series, so stay tuned. Thanks for watching.